The Danville Police Department could get a much needed building expansion. Yeah, the city's proposed budget for the upcoming year includes money to begin the process of building a new and improved police station. WSLS 10's Coulter Anstead live outside the police department tonight. So Coulter, how much money is going to cost if they want to build this? Uh, John, right now we're talking about 16.1 million. That's what the city is guessing will have to be spent both for planning uh, uh, both for planning and construction or renovation of the new police department. And as you alluded to in the proposed budget for the upcoming fiscal year, the city is proposing to allocate money for the planning and design of a new police station. The Danville Police Department currently has about 12,000 square feet of space. While the department is technically located on the bottom floor of City Hall, it is actually spread out between City Hall, the city's library, and precincts on Green Street and 3rd Avenue. This building was never designed for technology. It was never designed for modern uh, occupation of offices. It had to be retrofitted a number of times. One example is the work done in 1999 to create more office space. They took the storage space and they also took our personal space, which would have been our um, lounge and those types of things. The department also needs more security. Most of the offices are located in a hallway that is accessible by the public, and the hallway has multiple access points. Even here, you've got an open space. This is an open door that people can come in at any time. You've got the chief's office, you've got patrol, you've got the lieutenant's office. The city is proposing allocating $100,000 from the general fund in the upcoming budget to pay for a consultant to design a new police station. The proposed capital improvement plan in the upcoming budget proposes tentatively allocating $16 million in the FY19 budget for construction. We're not going to restrict ourselves to any one particular way of doing things. The city manager anticipates a bond referendum in order to borrow enough money to pay for the project. Anticipated cost exceeds the city's ability to borrow funds in one fiscal year. Uh, without uh, a voter approved bond referendum. The budget is scheduled to be voted on at the June 20th council meeting. As for where the new police station might be built, City Manager Ken Larking says that will depend on what the consultant determines is needed as far as the layout, the exact amount of space, etc. But he said renovating an existing building and constructing a new building are both options on the table at this point. Live in Danville, Coulter Anstat, WSLS 10. All right, thank you, Coulter.